you're on your weight loss journey or you're changing your lifestyle around and someone comes with your favorite dessert or snack to say thank you or one thing to cheer you up, what do you do? Should you have it or not? It is a tricky question. It is a tricky question because you don't want to make the other person feel bad. You feel you have to because that person made the effort to bring you something. But you know very well deep down that it's actually not going to serve you. So what are you doing? Well, most of us then get tempted and have it anyway. And it's like, well, I can't do anything about it. I feel I have to have it. But do you really have to have it? And that's the big question. But more importantly, the question is, do you have to have it there and then? Or could you have it when it is your choice to have it? And that's the big difference, is that when you eat something or drink something, when you feel pressured, that's where the guilt comes in and you feel like you have failed. If you say thank you very much, you put it aside and you have it when you feel that it is time to have it, then at that point, it's very, very different. The feeling of having it is not associated to guilt, but it's one of choice. So you can always tell the person, thank you very much, I'll have it later, because right now, I had my dinner, I'm not hungry, I don't need it. But I love what you brought for me, and I really appreciate it, and I can tell you, I'll let you know when I'll have it, and well, I'll have really, really enjoyed it, and um, it felt good to have it as opposed to feeling guilty. That last bit, you don't have to say. That's something that you have to think inside yourself. So it's okay to take it. It's not okay to feel pressurized to eat it or drink it there and then. Now, if you really wanna go one step further and make sure that people don't bring you your favorite snack for any reason at all, then it's up to you to go and tell them what you're doing, how you're trying to change, and that as much as you appreciate them wanting to cheer you up or um, say thank you, you would love to have that with a different type of gesture as opposed to your favorite snack or drink. So that's kind of the next step that you can take, but you don't have to take it if you don't want it. It's totally up to you which way you wanna go, but if you feel that you can't say, please don't bring me anything, then make sure that you only have it when you choose to have it, as opposed to when someone else feels that you have to have it and then you associate guilt to it. I hope that's helpful. And if you have any questions, feel free to comment and I'll be happy to help you further. Bye for now.